Hi, it's Aidy and welcome to my channel. Today I am making things with circles. I'm showing you showing you what to do. They're so random, they're just random things, and also with um, cutouts and uh, well, thumb notches. Or I mean, I've collected some somewhere, but I don't know where they are. But these, a lot of these are drawn ones. Um, that was one of those little circles cut in half because it fitted. Okay, um, random, just to, just to give you ideas on what to do uh, with scrap paper what to use them on, how to use designs that went wrong. One, for example, I've cut some out of that, I've cut one out of that one. Design that I'm not keen on that, but I mean, that would make a nice random um, circle. I'm not sure where it is, but hey. Okay, so if you like my content today, please give me a thumbs up. That would be absolutely amazing, and I'd really appreciate that. And it does help you... To my uh, my videos on YouTube to be seen, and also if you give me if you've um, subscribed to my channel, thank you so much. And if you'd like to do that for me, if you haven't already, that would be absolutely amazing. Also, um, I've got papers on Kofi which are like this. I've got that's my latest one. It's an A4, which can be made into um, other sizes. Okay. Um, Things like that. that's one that you have, that's one of my latest. Kofi, as in free paper, you can just grab it off there. But I'd like to, you know, I'd love you to give me a message if you can to let me know if you've, if you've used your paper. That'd be amazing. Like people do, people have, and I, I, I really do appreciate that. Um, what I was going to tell you, that's it. Isn't it? Yeah, so let's go now and I'll show you how to be random. <laughs> okay. Right then, this is what we're doing today. This is what I've been doing, and I think it looks absolutely amazing. It's so simple to do. Um, various, I mean, that's you've done them before. That's like whimsical flowers, so they're very similar. That's whimsical butterflies. We've done them before, but I've been doing just plain ordinary circles, and I know they will look absolutely fantastic. And I've got things like this, and I thought, well, yeah, I'm going to throw that away because I don't like it. But I'm going to try and use it actually. Now I've got. I keep moving, trying to move either side of the camera because <laughs> it's right on my nose. <laughs> right. So what I'm going to do is instead of um, throwing it away, I'm going to. This is what I've been doing: just drawing a circle and coloring and doing little doodles, anything. And you can have a look in a minute. I'll show you how amazing it looks. So you do little th things like that circle. And I find me good scissors because I've lost another pair. I've got another pair. I've got another pair like this without the thing on. And I don't know where it is. The things over there, but they're downstairs. I thought to myself, I won't lose them. So now this is only, only paper, but I'm using paper. I'm using cardstock. I'm using everything, and it all works together. That's in there. That's in between medium and large, isn't it? So it'll go in the medium thing. What's all that activity about? The dogs jumping around everywhere. Right, and things like this. I mean, you've got this is a digital. I've got that. I just scribbled on that as well, like that. It's just a circle. If you can't, you don't have to draw a perfect circle. I mean, you could cut out, you could cut them out of punches, but no, I think this looks. I've got plenty of punches I could use, but I'm not going to, because I think this looks absolutely amazing. Unless Alex has come back, has he? No, he hasn't come back yet. Alex, Nika, <laughs> it's not time yet. Right, so that can go in there. So I've got things like that. I've also got. Um, yeah, there's my leaves. I've cut some things as well out of this. I've been drawing them and I've also cut them. So I don't know whether it would go together. I mean, I've got things like that. Those, you know, those ones you've, you've cut off your, your thumb notches. So I've collected some of those. I've got plenty somewhere. I don't know. Oh, some even more over there. What's underneath? Oh, it's actually, it's actually on the desk, not in the box. So that's good. There's another one. So either side of that. No, no more. Oh, circle. I don't know. I could perhaps use you could perhaps use circles like that actually if you don't want to uh, cut them out and just draw some sort of a squiggly line on that'd be quite good. I mean, there's that option as well. Yeah, I haven't really done that. I've just cut them out because I find it quite easy, especially with this really sharp pair of scissors. And you've got to be careful. You have it has actually it does actually come with a little thing, so it's um, that's the warning in itself, really. And <laughs> did I? I didn't do a leaf one, did I? So I've got that leafy paper. Just do that. You don't have to do. Um, I've got plane. Let me show you on the. I'm going to show you one on the plane in a minute. On the plane. On the plane. <laughs> no, we don't know. Um, plane paper. Right. 
so that goes in there so now i've got a leaf if you want so anything anything any pattern paper oh yeah i've got another idea and i did use some yesterday but it's not obvious got things like this the inside of an envelope the um now where did i get that idea from marcella yeah she's always using this and i think that's a brilliant idea they could use that as well i have actually i'll show you which one it is in a minute i've got i've actually got some it's not patterned it's perfectly plain and it's the most nice green colour so so that's another idea so if you've got i mean the black i love the black one's better but we've got the um the blue ones a lot over here um yeah there's another yeah so all these yeah this is ones i cut earlier as well that shape okay so let's find a plain one to show you let's see if i've got that paper i'm gonna quickly see here it is yeah here's the envelope we've got nice green on this envelope okay that's plain so did i make patterns i don't know if i made patterns on them i must have done i must have made patterns so you just do a doesn't matter you got i've got three three or four different sizes so they can all interact can't they and i'm going to show you what i use them for in a minute but it's such so easy to do and so simple so just cut around so i basically do that and then i cut it off <laughs> go around cut it off and anything goes look, I've got, all i'm using is black and white i'm using uni poskers black and white and you can oh <laughs> i forgot it's not screwed down anymore screwed down stuck down uh, you could do things like that i'm just scribbling around the edge uh, there we go and and also i'm going to do a little scribble in the middle with the thinner one i think the black uni posca okay things like that that you think is looks absolutely nothing it's not on its own just just a little circle I've scribbled with anyway that's plain you can do anything plain I'll show you some of the little designs I've done it's plain on the plane yeah on the plane in Spain yeah <laughs> on that on the plane in Spain there we go um yeah I just want to sing there's one plain that's plain paper just a little squiggle with little circles and dots that's um a coloured paper I've got just got colour on it there's one I've done I've done it over that's over sort of book page it's not book page it's my the middle button type that's plain they're plain so it's like a telephone dial but went a bit further <laughs> and just lines on that one so anything like that and they've even drawn over some of the colored ones as well that's a plain one just hold on so that sort of thing so we, we're abs doing absolutely so well aren't we i've got loads and they're quite addictive and because they're so easy and quick to do i did it in batches of well, i did a four i did about four large ones which are these i've got some more there look they're only the small ones <laughs> um and the medium one uh oh, oh, i don't know perhaps are the medium ones then because these are the small aren't they all right and then i've got um did about four large ones on plain paper and that one's just on a digital just drawing around it I can leave it like that so you can add a bit of a pattern but anyway i've got a little idea of course as i do uh, i'd also got another originally i was going to do but I've, we've already done them so um i think well, it turns out that we've already done this so i probably would have actually got round to it i was inspired by kari um kari on um mixed media art started doing things like this as well and I started with little ones short ones and i thought i'd extend that because i love that just a, all it is a simple flower if you want to, this is just to add addition to the other one i just put some dots spaced out and then i did some petals opposite each other sort of circly things and then I turned them round so they're not all the same way and just made a little border so that makes another border so that's what i was doing first and then i started doing um oh, that's got creased hold on hold on without creasing it um so then I started doing these, and I thought these make such cute little ideas, don't they? Why have I got that? Why have I got a sticker? I've still got sticker stuff from the other day on the desk. Yeah, just come, just leave the desk, and yeah, well, I don't know why I do that. I mean, everybody else seems to tidy it up, don't they? They all say it. They all say, oh, I always tidy my desk after each session. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> and I'm thinking. Um, I'll do that next time. I don't mind tidying the desk, but I don't do it after or, or before each session. I just do it sometimes. In fact, I was going to do it today. But my daughter came round with my grandson. So I'm going to see if I've got enough room on there. I don't know if I have. 
to make two. So I'm making a three by four if I can see where I am. Yeah, like this. I don't know why I'm using this. I think it's because it cuts. The other one's decided to go raggy, which is fair enough. It can do what it likes. I'm going to have to get a new. Um, yeah, that's a bit shorter. I'm going to. Well, I don't know if I can still use it, can't I? For demo, especially for demo purposes. Uh, where did I put? My, it's always hiding. My uh, corner round, I've got one actually. Do it. I use this one, that's, that's the one I use this. So this is Brusho, um, what I've got on here. So it's the powder paint where you spray, put the powder on, spray again, etc. You can mess about like that or you can do it either way. Put the powder on, then spray it. Still a bit powdery. And I was thinking of making some journaling cards using these as decoration. And what I was thinking of doing, or well, perhaps I could leave that there. And do it down this. I'm going to do it down one side. I don't know. I'm going to just use anything like this, for example, and then just put anything down. In other words, use the same size, or you could space them out. So if you've only made a few so far and you want to space them out, I think they're against this sort of like, um, what do you call it, blurred sort of look, isn't it? Sort of blurred look that looks really sharp, and I like that. So, and that. So you could do things like that, four of those down there. Wouldn't that look amazing? You could make them a bit more closer together. So I've made loads of these. I didn't, didn't I showed you how to make them quickly, didn't I? So we didn't make loads and loads. So you could do things, that looks nice. And then um, I did, I don't know where they are. <laughs> of course I don't know where they are. I've got some words somewhere that I actually redid. Oh no, they're the ones I actually made, yeah. On uh, just did it, did some more of these, and I copied the ones I'd already got. So, if you've got something like words, or you can draw them like me, I mean, I um, what's her name, Marcella, who um, is often on the group, she um, she tends to, she's got a thing where I can't find it myself, but there's a thing where you can find fonts and you can copy them. She copies the fonts. Yeah, the whistle, I don't know why that happened, up fonts. My husband says when I get excited, I start to go, start to pronounce my S's a lot. <laughs> so if I'm doing that, you know why? <laughs> I don't even know I'm doing it, so. Uh, so when you, when you, because, uh, <laughs> you start to pronounce your S's. <laughs> I don't know if that looks right. Um, or should we put that down there? I don't know. I don't know, it might not, it might not even work. <laughs> but it might some, somewhere. I'll do a little roundy bit, so I'm just rounding the corners. Right, that would it. <laughs> Catching it with my... These are so sharp, you can do this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're brand new and sharp, so I don't know what happened to the... I don't know whether that would work. Yeah, woodwork and hangover. <laughs> um, oh, that's another thing you could perhaps try as well. Let's have a go at that. Um, <laughs> hangover. <laughs> you could perhaps hang them over the side and either cut them off or leave them. I have different colours. You don't have to have. I mean, I've used muted colours rather than brights. You could do that, or you could space them out and do it, and then cut the edges off. And you can. Oh, I've got the two here. Look, we don't want to be apart. Yeah. Right. So you cut the edges off there, and perhaps use the edges on your and other things. I'm not sure if I can show you what I mean by them other things. Anyway. That you could cut the edges off there, you could, oh, um, yeah, I've got an idea. Ah, I see things coming to me as I'm um, on, this is one of my favourite ones. There's one. Perhaps that down one side, those, those down one side and that idea down the other. Or shall we do it like that? Or completely leave that blank and just have all the business down this end. <laughs> there we go. Or this. So all these ideas, look. You could try these. I mean, I'm, all I'm doing here is doing like those doodles we did the other day on... Um, uh, what's it called? Doodle? I know it's about doodling edges. Doodling edges. That's quite, very, quite a popular video, actually. <laughs> so... Um, Something like that, or I don't know, plenty smaller ones. Oh no, we're not having the same colour together. You could have the same colour together, but it's up to it's up to you. 
there we go well that's that's a swirly one it's another swirly one let's move that one instead love your friend there we go that's that friend right something like that to decorate it I ought to put my money where my mouth is and do it didn't i really um i don't know let me just try something else i don't know if it's going to be too much so I've got to have a use. I mean, these aren't what I made on video the other day. These are um, what I was thinking about an idea, and I was making little short ones. I don't know where they are now. There's only little short ones. Short ones. Well, oh, there's some. I've got a few little short ones. Oh, that's one of my favourite. I love this. This is very similar to that. That's an idea I like. Right. Have a different colour. See, there's a bright one, but hey. <laughs> right, and then we can put, um, and then perhaps even these. Is that too much? I don't know. I just, just, just trying out some ideas. But I like the idea of overlapping and that. I don't know. Then you could perhaps no. I think that would. Uh, I'd have to have that down there, if I put one at all. Oh, I could go completely simple and have that. What have I got on the other side? Plain white. It's, this is um, quite thick card. It's actually got... Um, it's a £140 card. I think it's 300 gram uh, um, GSM, £140. I don't know. Something. There's something in it somewhere. Oh, that one's underneath. I wonder if that would. Yeah. I was thinking you could put something. I don't know, down there. Cover them in it, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, three would go, lot, three big ones, or you could have some small ones. Right, let's get some more big ones. See, those are very random. Everything is totally random. And then, oh, that's the same as that. Apart from that, I'm going to change it. There we go. Yeah, that looks, I like that. So you could do something like that on one side, couldn't you? I would ink that up or put something on it. Uh, I don't know whether that would, I'm trying to, my hardest to fit this in. <laughs> plenty, <laughs> plenty, plenty of, um, Boulders, they look about like boulders. And, uh, yeah, plenty of those. Um, not completely covered. Yeah. Some overlapping and some not. And also, another idea was, and I forgot to use my big journal, haven't I? Because I don't know where the other ones are. I was going to use a notebook journal, but things like this always look nice on light on um, dull pages, don't they? Like that brown. There's this. If I can lift up the middle, because it's a very, it's one of those journals with the. Um, <laughs> what else could I put that underneath a minute? We could put things like that down, any, any random thing down the side of the page. Right, things like that. Can you see? Oh, you can't even see. <laughs> I was thinking I was showing you. <laughs> there we go, that sort of thing. So I should have switched straight to that because obviously I wasn't showing you. I was just... So there's that sort of thing here. You can alternate into small, but I've done that on purpose randomly. Biggish ones and then small ones and then a big one at the end. 
we can do that that's a design idea that looks completely straight to me on the camera it looks like it's going that way um so that and i would actually have the type the right way around it's got any type on it i really like that I like the journaling one as well, but I really, really like that. And obviously you've got things like this. I've got one. I've got it in. Oh, it's in the other. I put it in another journal, but which has decided to walk away. Right. If I was going to put this on here, I'm going to quickly do it. There's the pin lock. Keep an eye on that. Well, let's crease that one up. Yeah, let's crease that one a bit, but hey. Yeah, that one was sort of like on there, wasn't it? And I didn't even know. So that one's gone off in a Mardi now, as we say. It's, we say that in it round here and also in the north of England. <laughs> Haven't gone off in a Mardi means it's gone off sulk. In, his, in it, having a sulk. Right there. So that's, look at that, a nice they look down the side of a page. I think that's, that's a nice flat page as well, isn't it? If you wanted a flat page as well. Flat page design. And also if you wanted a, a flat, I'm going to do a different, let's do a different design on my... Um, because I've used some of those, haven't I now? I've used some of those, so I'll use some of those on here. I'm going to do it first. I'm going to do a inking up session on here. I'm going to get a bit close to the camera because I have to reach across them. <laughs> yeah, so if you hear my voice get a bit louder, that's why. But where's my... Have um, I got my... Oh, I've, got the, I've got the Express, so I've got some, I've got some archival ink as well. But I'll use this. Okay, to go around the head and on the back as well, actually, because then you've got that. Oh, because I suppose you could also decorate this side, couldn't you, with something if you wanted. Right, so I would, I would do it down here because that looks fairly interesting enough. So I would do it down there. Put one of those on. That would actually go quite well with that. Um, the colours, colour wise. I've got a green one somewhere that looks really nice. I don't know where it is. <laughs> no idea. It's somewhere. Oh no. Oh no. That's not it. I meant the flower. I meant flowery. But uh, I've got a flowery one. Oh, I might have put it in the journal already. Actually, right. So there's that idea. So and also you could have the tiny. What about all the tiny ones down here? So that's going to take me a long time, isn't it, to pull you down? <laughs> right. So all the smaller ones. Um, I'm gonna, it looks like I'm going to start repeating, so I won't put that. Um, and yeah, uh, no, yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah. They're quite addictive to make. That looks nice, actually. I do like that. I like it better than the one when I did it all over. So that would be fine. I don't know if it's because I've enclosed that a bit now. It looks a bit better. <clears throat> Because that's just the edge of the card where it wasn't done, wasn't it? So I'm going to put these on now. Whoops, <laughs> knocking my glue. So hopefully, I'm going to know, I don't know, it's going to be sort of... Oh, let's put them on. Because <laughs> I don't know if it's going to be at the right, the right, um, the right thing, do I? I'm going to move that up a bit. I've got a bit of paper underneath there. <laughs> Let's put that there. Because it was too far down in, uh, uh, up anyway, wasn't it? So that's made from paper, so it's a bit... There we go. And you can use things like watercolours to do your background if you haven't got brusho. Uh, there's faux brusho that, uh, that Marcy showed me recently, where you can get those... Is it East, oh, this is in the USA. Easter eggs... Um, what they call them, you can crush little uh, blocks into powders and then use them as faux brush. I think they come quite, must become quite pastel well, but I think they, look, they would look good. Oh, they come out as different colours like the brush I does as well. If you put a certain colour on, it'll come out as all the colours it's made from, which is good. I did that at school actually. We did an um, experiment at school where we, probably at the junior, <laughs> junior school, which is... Um, he was about ten when I was about ten or eleven. 
I'm sure it was about that age. And we um, got a black felt tip pen, you know, fibre tip, whatever you might call it. And put it in water, well, got water or something. And then it, it, all the colours it was made from. And I remember there was things like yellows and greens in there. So I thought that was quite interesting. So that's similar. So that might be what it does. That's, that's, that's the sort of stuff I like. Anyway, there we go. That's your thing. I was thinking, uh, can we put something on that side? I don't know. Or shall we leave it? <laughs> a couple of big ones or something. Uh, three big ones down the side. Uh, different colours. Right, OK. No, I'm going through that one. See, that one's not even a circle. That's flat. <laughs> and it's still, I can still, it's still absolutely fine to use. They're all trying to join in. And that's fine on white as well, though. I'll leave that and I absolutely adore that and absolutely adore the page I've done so there's that sort of thing as I say you can um, let's get another let's use this a minute I'm going to use this for those other things I did um, or right ah, actually I've done this lately I don't think it's going to work on this though <laughs> masterboard like you've never seen that's the sort of thing I've done here it's not quite as good as the ones <laughs> I did on that, but um, well, it, it could be. I mean, I just got to add a bit more and mess about a bit more. But you know those... Oh, I'm trying to do it. I'm trying to get that on there. I saw somebody had done on, on theirs. Uh, not not anybody. I think it's somebody probably professional. So that's why it would look so good. But I've got things like this and these. And, I, and what I did, what they did was, what I did, yeah, I did it. No, I didn't. I didn't do it. They did some um, of these shapes. They have those shapes, I don't know, we could use, I'm not going to do it because it, it might get in the way, but they had all these shapes just painted actually on there, and it looked amazing. So I've cut, I would edge that up because it looks a bit bland. And they've got things like this on there as well, so, you know, I've, I've got some examples somewhere, but I'm not sure. <laughs> I'd have to print it out unless I could find any. Um... Vehicle's turning left, by the way. Can you hear that? <laughs> Vehicle's turning left. It's the we've got big lorry. We've got a big lorry. It's very quiet around here, and then you get these lorries. Okay, so what is it trucks? People say, right, massive ones. So there were those in this sort of design, and I have, I have used them in in some of my designs. That's where I got the idea from. Somebody else's, and it looked really nice. So I could copy some of these and put them on, including things like this. Could copy that i mean it's only a little bit so you could get the or you could be inspired by it and there's that as well you've got choice there of little flowers or of big flowers <laughs> yeah i'm oh, dropping them on the floor now i'll find them in a minute right so that's an idea and also an idea is oh where is it wait a minute an idea is this as well i'm going to get a knock on the door in a minute so if you hear it called bang you know why some, yeah, I told you. <laughs> I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Right, I'll just go, I'll show you that when I come back then. Some ideas, okay. Oh, that looks quite good. Right, so this card's a bit shorter than that one. So what I could do, I just put some on there, didn't I? And I moved them. They look quite good. There we go, so that one, for example... Um, I mean, I don't know why I've done that. You can do it. Don't have to do that. You can do it like that, or you can get one exactly the same size. But I think they look better when you've got them different sizes. I've got any really another really tiny one, and we can put that on. It's too big, isn't it? I suppose you could cut one of those in half if you wanted something really small. I don't know whether I've got anything really small like that. I mean, that would be like one of those. The that's only that's put by a, a, a um, punch, but that wasn't. That was just drawn as a circle. Then I cut them in half. So you can also do that. Let's cut that plain one. I know it's pink, but yeah, I can hear people moving around. It's because they're going to the shop, right? Um, oh, that looks quite nice. Even when I haven't got the, I'm going to put one anyway. Let's put a little. I'm going to put a little dotted line there and then I'm going to check as if you can see because <laughs> I'm aware sometimes it's a bit low isn't it right so what I've done there is got those I think they look quite nice don't they now really sort of abstract arty look there I've 
gone around that edge already with a um, thing. <laughs> corner uh, not corner. That's not corner round, is it? Yeah, I've already gone the. Yeah, I say I've actually gone around the edge with a corner rounder. So we've done that. <laughs> I, but I don't mean that. I don't know if you can see. Oh, you can see my drink. Look, it's there. Yeah, my husband's just made me a, a drink when we came back from the dog walk. Right. Um, but, but they're going to get go and look for some distilled white vinegar. Oh, at the moment. Oh, let's put that there. There we go. Right, I'm going to put that in the middle like that. So it's sort of like. But it would, I don't know. I think. In this case, I think in the middle, so you can decide. You don't have to do it in the middle. You don't. Have, you can do it to one side. And um, oh, I don't know, not nice other one. And there, so that sort of thing. So you'll find these are all different shapes and sizes. You can make them as I've done this, that, and obviously I've made that as well. Um, so that one goes there. You can make them a lot smaller and do lots of different ones. I'm going to be top heavy. Shall we just see what that looks like on there? That looks better. No, I think that looks better. You can also see what it looks like upside down as well because that could be any way up. I'm going to have a look. Oh, it's got that on the back because it's. I've done it with marker. Uniposca doesn't go through usually. Am I too far down again? I hate that when I'm right down the bottom and I've got all this space there. Yeah, I know. I'm going to move the. I'm going to move this actually. So we so we don't so we're more in the middle now. So there we go. You can don't have to do it straight. You could do it at an angle as well if you like. Like for example that, like this. <laughs> I think that I did it earlier when I went just before I went out. And I think something like that would look good. A couple of them going up the page or down the page. Let's try that one first. <laughs> so I didn't want to join in. Right, and then, oh, the dog just not. Right, so I'm going to do, because I think I've left too much of a gap there. Um, oh, that, that doesn't look too bad, does it, when it's at the bottom? So I'm going to, just going to do some circly things. That's a couple here, I don't know. Just for the sake of it, really, because I'm going to put a bit of white on them. A few white dots here and there would be great, wouldn't that? Yeah. Some white dots here and there, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that looks good, doesn't it? <laughs> That's made that into something else. Yeah, so you've got things, you can do things for anything you like. I mean, you can join in, yeah, like that. And, but that or that, whatever. I don't know, it's a bit like a, a pram. I don't, not, not, I don't know why it doesn't look that way around, but <laughs> looking at it that way around, it looks like it should be that way around and there's a pram there. An old fashioned pram. Yeah. Um, not with that, perhaps. Okay. Um, yeah, <laughs> no, perhaps not. Right, so I can go along the edge with this as well. I've got lots of. I mean, I'll think of lots and lots of ideas um, afterwards as well. So I might put some up, but they look so amazing, don't they? And then obviously you've got the um, page idea as well. Let's get that back. I've got to find it though because I've no idea where I put it. Just a minute. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ah, I've just seen it. There it is. So there we go. So there's this idea and this idea. I mean, you can make do pockets as well, couldn't you? And put those along the top. Coming to showing. Right, okay, I'll start again because I was right down there. Right, there's my page idea. So you've got that. You could also do a pocket idea or use that as a journaling card as it is, which I think is amazing. And I think that's great, isn't it? Use up your little bits. You've got some little bits. I mean, that's I've made these some scraps. Um, got a bit of scrapped coloured paper, digital or 12 by 12 or 6 by 6. You think, oh, that's so pretty, I still want to use it. Just do something around the edge and then use it in the middle. I've got I've got some little paper like that as well, actually. So 8 by 8 by 6 paper and I absolutely adore it. And I wish there was more of it and I wish I could find it as a digital. <laughs> it's, um, well, I'm sure, oh yeah, I've got to get that out. Look, because guess what I've got in there? My pin. I forgot about that, didn't I? So... That's keeping my page. Right, okay, so there you can do it obviously that way round, that way round, that's a shorter one, that way round or that way round. I think it looks better that way, personally, and that one that way. And then you can draw lines on the back, you could put more on there, you could put, as I say, you can put half on there like that, or even those little, where are they? Even those ones that's already cut, you could use those because they are straight edges. 
You don't already put those. I've done that in a somewhere, haven't I? Before, in a in a in a video where I've got the edges like that. I'm trying to make some. I'm trying to find some small ones, but I can't only find big ones. <laughs> and I'm trying to use that one. I could do it like that even to make them. There you go, like that. So there. So you've got some f thought processes here because I didn't know what I was doing. I had no idea. All I'd known is got these. And I know that they look nice. You could overlap them. You could do that down side. Yeah. So you could even do two of those. And then on the other side, put their counterparts on the other side as well. That'd be quite nice. I don't know if I've got the one. Where is my... Th oh, I've got some... I've got, say I've got a leaf one somewhere. But I don't know where it is. No idea where it is. It's somewhere there. Oh! That's it, isn't it? So you've got that on that side. You could put the other one on the other side like that. That's actually it's not a proper, proper safe so if, if you did them in circles and then cut them in half. There we go, like that, and put the other ones on the other side. Oh. Just to make it sort of match. Yeah, so anything random like that. Let's put a circle on there. <laughs> Try it, couldn't you? Right, okay, so. Obviously you might not like that plain white, there's ways of colouring that in, watercolours or sprays or um, brushing ink on, light coloured ink on. That's already got... And then you can add... I can't see if that's actually colored in because I've got something in my eyes. I get this, apparently it's migraine and it blocks my vision a bit. doesn't make me ill, it just blocks my vision. <laughs> so, I'm going to put a tiny bit of water on that, yeah right, let's see if it does it. So that's already got green on it, are you? Uh, yeah. yeah. So I'm going to move it out of the way so it doesn't go to everywhere else. And then you can put it like, scribble it on. Like that. I'm always doing this to stuff. Or if you've got the, if you've got to, if you found, if, if you can find your tea towel. <laughs> I think mine is actually, I found it the other day. You can find your tea dye one, unlike me. I don't know where it is again. It's gone. Um, you could use the brown one if you like, or you can use what colour you like. You don't have to. Oh, don't think that thumbprints on them actually does a little bit of a pattern there. Yeah. So there. So there. You've got that. Could go a bit on this as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Just round the edges. Let's try around the edges because I've already got that colour on the front. Yeah. How about that. There you go, you could even use that as good at journaling lights. <laughs> yeah, so that's, um, well, there we go then. So that's your ideas then, brilliant ideas, aren't they, hopefully. Um, that would be my pack. Can you see that? It's it's because it's it's so big, this journal, it's slanting down. So you'd have to have, I think if you were using this journal, you'd have to put something under there. And that would make it stand up like that, wouldn't it? But it's so big. Okay, I'm going to fill it out a bit more as well. So if you if yours is really getting gay to mouth and you wanted some things to fill the pages, that is absolutely ideal as well. And you do, yeah, you wanted to and also if you also torn page art as well, I've got that. I've got a video on torn, torn page art and that does help with the gay to mouth. Although this this is absolutely so it's hardly got anything in it at the moment, so you know. I'm thinking of things to fill it out. Right, I'm gonna put that that way that that way and i'm going to take a photograph of that in a bit also i'm going to do me me intro intro as well okay then so i do hope you like my co come here she's not showing you as usual i do hope you like my content today i absolutely adore this yes it is at an angle now so sorry about that if it's it does bother me when things are at an angle you know not with drinks here still four if you can see my cup of tea there a lot <laughs> there it is yeah cup of tea yeah, maybe the tea bags in the teapot. Yeah, I always do that. I don't like it just in the in the mug, no way. Right, okay. I don't drink. I, don't, I wouldn't drink. In fact, I won't drink tea if it's not in the uh, actual made in the actual pot. Very often, anyway. Unless I really need a drink. <laughs> right, okay. So that's that. Okay. So um, if you like my content today? Give me a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up for liking it in the teapot only. <laughs> And also, uh, if you've subscribed to my channel already, thank you so much. But if you haven't, please subscribe. That will help my channel to grow. That that would be absolutely amazing. Um, I was going to tell you, apart from, um, oh, I've got papers on Kofi as well. It's um, that at the moment. It's my latest one. Um, a 
bit more of it there. I've got that whole leafy page on Kofi and it does include this at the edge as well, but you can either get rid of that or you can keep it, ink it up or put a bit of oxide on it <laughs> and all that. Okay, and yeah, I've put some tea dyed paper on the back printed. Okay, that is actually tea dyed um, paper as well. But I've used tea bags on top. Right, okay. Um, what else can I tell you? Yeah, that's it, I think. Apart from I'd like to say goodbye, obviously I'm not very good at saying bye, so that's why it takes me so long. Um, so bye now and thank you so much for watching today.